que es cuna de hombre So Julio, let's go back to our ring announcer, Jimmy Lennon Jr. 45 wins, four losses, one draw, 92 victories, only one defeat, one draw, and Tony Lopez. Lopez. Round one scheduled for 12. So the update to provided to us by the Chavez. He wants to get to that 100 fights quicker. Indeed. And he doesn't have to go search and look for a guy. He can go back to necessity. I think it was out of uh, desperate. He'll return down to what he was. That's punching Troy Fighter. Dismantling his opponents round by round. Strong resolution. He feels that Chavez has slipped a bit. He will look to a price to do that, he said, but everything you have to pay a price for. But you do pay the price sometimes against Julio. Very few people do. Punching all over the place. I don't think you've got the, the uh, accuracy with the right hand. And likes to close faster. Round one in the book. Now, historically, opponents of Chavez will go toe-to-toe, -to -toe, usually the rounds as he watches, comes in and starts to solve in his mind what he has. Tailed at 89 by John John Molina. Chavez, of course, has never been. He usually comes in winging. He's, he's a usually real throwback to the fighter. <laughs> Lopez said he's going to have to watch the double head or body then counters and usually makes his opponent pay when the opponent Lopez has a powerful left hook. Although that didn't really connect all that solidly. Looking from a headbutt in round eight. He told us he usually cuts from punch. And that oh. is it for round two there. And when the bell rings, there's the shot. And the bell has just rung. And look at the red. I mean, that was like six months ago. Not enough. When you're in with it. When he's got the message, he says, uh-oh, if that's going to be the case, let me get started now. Good blow by Chavez. Lightweight champion. Going to the body now is Julio Cesar Chavez. Our company sponsoring Julio Cesar Chavez. That's what it says. This is attention. It bothered him a little bit. Midway through the third. And we better get started. That one. This almost what Emmanuel Sturt said he's going to do. I mean, uh, at the beginning. 40s right now. I'd say the mid 40s. It is right. cold. By Chavez. And no blood from the left eye of Tony Lopez. Round four of this WBC super lightweight champ. His eye got purple and nasty right away. It's very swollen over the, over the top of his uh, spread. Haugen. Colgate punch there to the, to the body. He's going to leave. That right hand blocker, and he can really take a punch. We, we have no pistol. There's the left jab by Chavez. But good. Now go. Chavez moving. It's about his trade. And tonight, chance of a lifetime in the job. You're the brother of Tony Lopez saying it's not one punch. It's two challenger in the Tony the top. A lot of movement here from Lopez. Protection to the dance. I mean, he's still boxing around and doing, you know. Slow walk you down, as we say. Lopez invites and heats up. Round some much steam in uh, in his punches. We love between these two. Just uh, business and opportunity ahead of him. Cut the gloves and then a right hand by Chavez. All right, it comes to round five. Cut of uh, Tony Lopez and has not opened further, and that's a mirror. It's cut but swelling. We saw that familiar pose of Chavez ready to uncoil back. But they have done a great job. Well, I'll tell you, coming off the three fights we've already had, uh, a, le a leaker, they say, just one or two drops came out and they, they club it. Let's see if he tries to go underneath, but that's where you really pay the price. And the side left of the head, that is hit prime, prime. Uh, he's beginning to land that right hand with good accuracy to the side. The round. Besides being tough, Lopez does have some good... Defeat by Lopez. Again, having no impact. This is a pretty good Sacramento, California, rated number two. But you get your opportunities are satisfied with what he's doing. Why shouldn't they be? He's going to Chavez is clearly taking control. Although Lopez has come out this round with some beginning to go toe to toe now with Julio and a combination fourth brawling like that. Uh, but it'll only get you so far with Chavez. Every once in a while, Chavez. Lopez continues his on right hand. Oh, there was a knife for cut by Chavez. Like right there. 
And there. And there. And he took by Julio. Lopez, he got hit with a real good shot that stunned him. Look at that right hand he landed. Good right by Lopez. In the ring. In the ring. As bad as Benny Briscoe? One, two, L. Uh, you know what? It's amazing that Tony Lopez has been able to take this. Well, the doctor looking very closely. We begin round eight. He connects there, too, and a sense of urgency. A cut that opened on the last punch of... Okay, Chavez's punches are damaging. Look at... Guys, the butt. The referee says I didn't see that bottom butt. Okay, sir. Whenever you fight a fighter that jumps in and out, leaps in and out. Oh, a left, sweeping left by Chavez. I think he's got a little slip to look through right now. And it's hard enough with two right hands. Hasn't been. Just left hook by Chavez again. Father's him. How much time does Lopez have left, particularly with that eye? Let him continue. I, I agree with that. Uh, it, it, there wasn't any damage. Really going up round nine. Fight we do. You can't heal that. That's the that's scar that doesn't heal. And against the champion, Julio Cesar Chavez. Chavez has calmed down. Lopez got his attention too, giving him some. 5 4 and 1, 32 knockouts. Punches. Guy is really crazy. Body shots by Chavez. Twice as hard in the next round. Wild miss to the left by Chavez. By Chavez. And then he backs off as the bell sounds. Seems to have slowed up in, in sympathy with, with the fighters. It's almost like saying, well, the doctor goes, Ron, I'm sorry. Yeah, even uh, Chavez turned to the ref. No problem is the other eye is now close. There's a heavy right hand by Chavez. Chavez taking a little step back and, as if it's that far gone. All right, that's that's good. Providing some uh, consolation and sympathy for the challenger Tony Lopez. Round opened up the cut over the left eye of Tony Lopez, and it was downhill for victories. Julio Cesar Chavez really wanted to do this in front of his hometown fans of Huyacan, Mexico, to map out his plans for the near future. Of one minute, 41 seconds in round number 10, Cesar Chavez. He had to be injected. Um, he certainly had an injury to the muscle in his arm. Como siempre, como siempre mañana, nuevos en Culiacán la buena tarde. But you know boxing, I only get warmed up at the 10th round. We saw.